me teach you something. I'm still going to use money. I hope you don't mind. Um, let me use money. Watch this. I think I've taught it here. The anointing is like money. There are things the level of anointing you have can afford to produce. There are results that you are anointed is not enough. Everything that needs to be purchased in the realm of the spirit that is below the level of your anointing can be purchased. But every challenge higher than your level of anointing cannot be purchased. Watch this. I did the teaching this morning similar to this and I want to use that analogy. If I have, for instance, I'm not saying anointing is money, but if I have a thousand naira worth of the anointing, Ejimi, and if you need, it's within the jurisdiction of my anointing to produce it. Are you getting the point now? So when you come to me, I will be able to minister to you and give you an assurance that you are going back with a result. Are we together? But if, thank you, if what you need is um, let's say a miracle the equivalence of a phone of 50,000 am I anointed yes but the challenge he has is beyond the anointing that I possess to solve that problem don't just say anointing is anointing you are joking how God anointed Jesus look at the extent that's why he could do good every problem Jesus confronted was lower than his level of the anointing so there was flawless result I'm telling you this is it's a revelation God gave me the reason why some things happen and some don't happen is that those that happen are within the level of the anointing to be able to release it and those that are above it so I can lay hands on you falling down is under this but the miracle you need is above it so you will fall down and yet not have the miracle are you getting what i'm saying now you can come to me say man of god prophesy over my life i lay hands on you and you fall because the dynamics of being slain in the spirit is is, is the is a basic dimension of the anointing it does not mean you received anything so when you possess such a dimension of grace such that the major problems of mankind is within the jurisdiction of your grace to solve at that point you are a living blessing the woman with the issue of blood if she touched peter she would have kept bleeding correct yeah but she touched a man who was dripping anointing from head to toe when you saw jesus you knew that was it if you did not receive from Jesus, it was not a lapse of power. It was your dishonor and lack of discernment. Do we have such people in Zaria? Do we have such people in Nigeria? Men that you can carry your trouble with joy. With joy, not with suspicion. That the moment you land in Koinonia, before service starts, you are dancing because you said, the devil that did not stop me from coming here. That's the end of it. When people testify, I am touched not just by the testimony but I'm humbled that by grace we have been able to stay with God and grow to a level where now the anointing we possess is above their challenges this is a very deep secret that many of you will catch as you grow in ministry it's working in me it's working in me it's God's ability. God's ability is working in me. It's working in me. Listen, you know you possess an anointing when certain testimonies start repeating themselves. When you begin to hear repeated testimonies. Then you know the same way a woman cooks and before you get to her restaurant psychologically you have tasted the food because you know she's not going to tell you sorry today this year i'm burnt she's left that level that's why they put a price tag on their food you buy rubbish for 200 naira anything you see smoky or not you manage it because you know what you paid for but when you pay 10,000 naira for a meal, listen, what will make men leave their nation and come to you? Are you that important?
because you think your name is Joshua Selman are you that important that a man can let me tell you something most people say people are busy nobody is busy everybody's looking for solution if you become what they are running around looking for I promise you you can hold koinonia every day by 10 30 to 3 a.m in the morning notice the time 10 30 to 3 a.m men will still come and you'll be wondering are you not a government worker again and they will say the last person you prophesied to his salary for 30 years came to him in one year why should i want to labor like that you are not a blessing when you are not anointed i'm telling you this learn it understand this speak grammar speak hebrew words speak greek do anything you want to do if you cannot reveal christ he said great is the mystery of godliness christ is come in the flesh the world becoming flesh that men and women can carry their results a man comes here not loving god and hearing you speak something infects him he goes back and does not even know what is happening to him again Look how long it takes people in the body of Christ to adjust to spiritual things. They get born again in January. No passion in the atmospheres they got born again. It's in November they now consider being filled with the Holy Spirit. Oh no, there's no fire there. There is a way you can step into an anointing. Huh? The lifespan of your journey is one week. In one week it will look like you've been born again for 10 years because of the impact of the grace you came under i made a vow to myself i said i will never go to a ministry twice to reveal christ there twice no no that you invite me and say come again it's like pushing a wall let's keep pushing uh -uh. i prepare my spirit that if god grants me an opportunity to come to your city or your area then you know something dramatic will happen can men come to you are you that valuable I watch people trivialize the Holy Spirit I watch people trivialize the anointing and then somehow they think the key is just to receive laying on of hands oh man of God I came with a seed of one million just lay hands on me and then you go to another one lay hands on me and it's as if you are shopping for anointing and then you bring it and say now I have what it takes you are joking you are really joking you believe spiritual things are that cheap I came to challenge you there is where God is taking you to don't 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 rob yourself of the privilege of standing before nations to be a representation of the power and the grace and the glory of God look at the testimony of that dear lady 4.69 you get 4.69 if it's cheap try it go and prophesy to somebody after this night that you will come back with the same result and then you see that it's not so easy the anointing does not make the difference the anointing is the difference when Benny Hinn came to Nigeria two weeks ago look at the rush look at the preparation literally he kept the body of Christ at a standstill is it true that everything he shared you have never had it will you be honest to say you have never had it is it true that what he taught you has never been heard he has repeated it in many churches he has taught series on it So why seek him? Why crowd yourself outside in overflows? Why sit down and stream? Why cancel your programs? You didn't bring a man. You brought a grace. You brought an anointing. You brought a priceless ability that can turn the lives of people around. Now, foolish people say, what is there about them? No, no. When you honor a man, you don't honor a body. You honor sacrifice. You honor a depth of sacrifice that has afforded God space to move through that vessel in a mighty way. Listen, listen, look up. Let me tell you something. Come, David Dam. Let's assume David Dam has, let's assume that he has um, high blood pressure or HIV. Watch this. Don't you think 
God wants to heal him on Wednesday don't you think God wants to heal him next year the desire of God to heal him is the day someone who has paid the price to give God space to release that dimension of his possibility when that vessel appears his healing has come why do people sit on a wheelchair till an anointed man comes is it that that's the day God wanted to heal them that's the day the anointing that could solve that problem stepped in